Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing this look right here. Um, again, I did not film my foundation, so I'll leave my foundation routine down below. I already have a video on how I do it. It's pretty much the same. So today we use the Tartlet palette, um, the In Bloom one. I know they came out with another one. I'm not sure what it's called, but it has a different cover. But this one, let me tell you, this palette is gorgeous like gorgeous um this is actually my sister's palette and i borrowed it from her and let's just say she's not gonna get it back um if you guys want to see a more neutral look with this palette go ahead and let me know um but it has a lot of neutrals and of course i went for like the two dark ones you know so if you guys want to see how to get this look go ahead and keep on watching I'm going to set my eyes with um, Laura Mercier's translucent um, powder just so there's no fallout going on. You see my eye already starting to play me? If you see any water action, tears happening right there, this eye is going through a tough time at the moment. It's just struggling. So just ignore that. I'm going to go in with Smarty Pants and place this in the crease we're just going back and forth and you want it to go all the way from the inner corner to the outer corner look at that isn't that awesome okay so now we're gonna go in with a smaller tapered blending brush this is one of my favorites this is a morphe m513 i believe the number's rubbed off but i will put it in the description box down below and we're going to go in with Rebel. So just like that. And then go ahead and go back in with the brush you used when you used Smarty Pants. And then just kind of blend it. I'm not adding any more product. I'm just using whatever is left over on the brush. I'm going to go in with Leader, which is this really nice brown purple maroon color so beautiful so i'm gonna use this packing brush this is a morphe m408 brush and you just want to pack this color on your lid and kind of like shake it off because this tartlet palette is kind of messy like it has some fallout um and you don't want this to fall out all over your face and then you can go back in with this smaller tapered blending brush and go back in with Rebel and kind of just blend the two colors together. So there's no harsh lines at all. <laughs> My eye! Alright, and then you can just go back in, kind of blend out transition colors just so there's no harsh lines for a brow highlight i'm gonna go in with flower child um i know it's not like a really white stark color but since the eyes are so dark this will act as a perfect highlight without it being too white it looks a little crazy but we'll blend it out in a second all right and then we're Kind of going to do the same situation as we did on the top on the lower lash line. And then I'm going to go in with a little bit of Activist and mix both of these two. Um, and Activist is like a black brown. Really, really dark brown. Um, so I'm just going to apply that here. And I'm mixing it with Leader, which is our lid color, um, just so it has the same tone to it, but it's just a little darker. Okay, so next we're going to go in with Funny Girl and place this on the inner corner. And really highlight everything. 
So, now that my eyes are, like, completely blacked out, um, I went and applied some lashes. I'm not sure which ones I'm wearing, so I'll list them down in the description box. And I went ahead and lined my waterline with NYX's, um, Golden Bronze, um, slide-on eyeliner. I love this color. It's amazing, and it stays in the waterline all day. I just picked up the new Milani. I don't even know what those these are called. Amore Matte Metallics. So they're matte metallics um, lip creams. So these are by Milani. Um, so we're just going to go ahead and go in with Magic Wand. I'm just going to... She went for it. I mean, I like it. It's not too, like, intense in your face. And that was just one dip into here. Alright you guys, so that is it for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys have any requests or any questions, go ahead and leave them down below. Don't forget to thumbs up this video. And I'll see you guys in my next one.